Ah, oh, 2019. Everyone's out searching for diets, weight loss, fitness tips. Most importantly, everyone's trying to eat healthier. The typical New Year's resolutions. But really guys, New Year's resolutions? Nah. New Year's resolutions? I'm all about New Year's solutions. And it starts with pizza. Man, I'm in the mood for pizza. What is going on everybody? Eric the Electric coming back to you guys again. My Electric Empire with another video. And another, say it with me, Super Charge. Menu challenge, guys. You guys know what it is. You guys know that whenever I say those words, it's time for an epic fast food challenge. If you guys are new to supercharged menu challenges, what they essentially are, they're like my little play on the value menu challenge that graced the internet a few years ago. Everyone was going out and they were buying the entire value menu at whatever fast food establishment that they were choosing to dine at. And you know what, guys? I've done that. It's cool. But here on my channel, we take it up a few notches. So I go out to fast food restaurants and I order the entire value menu, except I order a lot more than just the value menu. Everyone, 2018 was fantastic. We did a ton of supercharged mini challenges over, I think I did like 12. That's a lot, guys. But everyone, there's a lot of fast food out there in the world, and I like my fast food. You guys know me. Last year, I did the Pizza Hut supercharged mini challenge, and I really want to do a lot more pizza challenges this year. So why not start off with Domino's? Maybe next time we'll be Little Caesars. $5 hot and ready? Come on, I'm all about that. But for now, we're gonna focus on Domino's. So without further ado, everyone, my friends, my family, my members of the Electric Empire, it's time to get supercharged with some Domino's. Let's do this. And everybody, it's Domino's. We gotta place our order on the phone. Thanks for calling Domino's. Thanks for calling Domino's. The next time you're at a public location and want some Domino's, order online. Next video, competitive eating in public, let me know. Hi there, I'd actually like to place an order for carryout, please. Hello? Hello, one large. What the? Hello? Hello? Yeah. You guys got something going on with the microphone. Okay, so I got a large cheese, what else is there? No, so it's an ultimate pepperoni feast, large. I'm gonna have a large. Yes. Do you hear that? Uh, some crackle or something? Yeah, something going on. Sorry, it's like blowing on my ear. Can I have an, a large okay. buffalo chicken pizza, please? Okay. And then one order of hot wings, please. Okay. One order of barbecue wings. Then I will have a Philly cheesesteak sandwich, please. The Mediterranean veggie sandwich, please. Then I'm gonna have the stuffed cheesy bread and then a chocolate lava crunch cake, please. Sorry, it's a little loud here. Can you try maybe sticking in the microphone a little better? What else do you guys have for dessert? Can I get a, oh sorry, uh, it's, uh, there's a cinnamon bread twist. Let's get the cinnamon bread twist, please. And yeah. that's right. gonna do it. I don't know what just happened, but wow, that was annoying. Woo! Goodness gracious, people. Anyways, it's time to go get the essentials at the store first. What is this? A bonus round item? Bonus round means dessert. You guys gotta stay tuned for it. Health and fitness. Alrighty, guys, now we got our goods. It's time to go get our dominoes. Mm -hmm. Alrighty, folks, we have our dominoes. It's time to get this home and get this all presentable. Whew, let me just, whoa, whoa, that was a fail, that was a fail. Let me just tell you guys right now, that is a lot of dominoes, people. That is insane. That's the most pizza I've ever bought in my life, and you know what, guys? I'm a little proud of myself right now. You guys have been requesting for me to do a Domino's challenge for ages now, and guess what, guys? I'm finally doing it. So we got our Domino's, but we had to get the essentials at the store as well. Now, I know a lot of you are going to go, Eric, you hate Domino's, dude. Why are you doing a Domino's challenge, guys? For being pizza that you can get in like 10 minutes, Domino's isn't that bad. We all know Pizza Hut's the best, closely followed by Little Caesars. Then we have Papa John's coming in at third, and then we have Domino's. Now, you guys have to let me know what your favorite pizza place is. I have to go ask Mrs. Electric what her favorite pizza place is. Hey, babe, so uh, what's your favorite pizza place? I think it's time to get couples therapy. Oh, goodness, I guess some questions you shouldn't ask. But anyways, guys, now that you guys have obviously let me know down below what your favorite pizza place is, we can get all this presentable. And I'm very, very, very excited to try these out, guys. Now, I'm not the biggest Pop-Tart fan. I'm a Toaster Strudel guy. But I'm an impulse buyer, everybody. These are limited edition. And so I'm not going to wait until next month's car collection. I decided I'm going to put this in this supercharged challenge. But that's going to come in the bonus round. Something sweet. That'll come in the bonus round, too. You guys will have to stay tuned for that. Thing is, guys, you can tell Domino's ain't playing games when you got grease soaking through the box. Alrighty, what's the first one? What's the first one? Whew. It doesn't really look like there's chicken on there, guys, but oh well. 
and let's get a drum roll going. That is our ultimate pepperoni pizza right there, guys. It doesn't really look like anything other than a normal pepperoni pizza, so I don't really know what makes it ultimate, but it looks good. At least there's no pineapple on this pizza because putting pineapple on pizza completely ruins it. If you guys disagree with me, sorry. Pineapple just doesn't belong on pizza. I know I'm gonna get a ton of you guys down below in the comments going, pineapple belongs on pizza, olives belong on pizza. Ew! None of those things belong on pizza, guys. It's like putting toenails on pizza. It just does not work. What am I doing, too? I feel like I'm in a dungeon right now. So that is their cheesy bread. This stuff is amazing. Oh my goodness. It smells sensational. <gasps> And we have our wings right here. Those are the barbecue wings, I'm assuming. Those look delicious. Not so nutritious. Hot wings, which I wanted to try, guys. You guys know. I'm a little pansy when it comes to spicy things, so hopefully those won't be too spicy. Bread bites. They're either Parmesan or garlic bread. So I guess I got a second order of bread bites. You know, I can always use extra bread in my life. Oh, snap. Oh, we have our lava cakes right there. But you know what, guys? Hold on. Before I get into this, I have to update my Snapchat and Instagram crew and let them know what I'm doing right now. If you guys haven't yet, you guys gotta follow me on Instagram and Snapchat. There's the electric. Snapchat crew, next challenge, everybody. You guys know, you gotta give the video a like if you poop today. Do it right now. I did. Now we've got to the point of the video, everybody, where I can let you guys know the total calories for this entire Domino Supercharged Mini Challenge that we have in front of us right here are gonna be right there for you guys. And because I have to do this, people, the total macros for this entire challenge, that means protein, carbs, fat, those are gonna be listed like right there for you guys. Now, without further ado, everyone, my friends and family, members of the Electric Empire, this is the Domino Supercharged Menu Challenge. Let's do this. And shout out to all my Dragon Ball Z fans. You guys know we got some of the power of Goku for this challenge. Now, the real question is, what do I start with first? I think I gotta start with one of these sandwiches first. Well, actually, you know what? They're both burned. I don't know. I think they're both going to taste the same. This one's the veggie, and that's the Philly cheesesteak. Let's start with this one. All right, guys. Let's get this started. And the first bite, it's fire. <sighs> this is the Philly cheesesteak. Regardless, it's good. Mediterranean veggie. There we go. I was gonna say shout out to all the vegans out there, but it's got cheese on it. Cheese is definitely not vegan. That's actually really good. All right, guys. Well, both the sandwiches are down. Now I think we got to move on to the pepperoni pizza. Let me just tell you guys right now, this pizza looks promising. Oh goodness, that's not the pepperoni pizza. Right there. Oh my goodness gracious, guys. That is a lot of pepperoni right there. Let's see what we got here. A little pepperoni action. Ooh, you guys gotta give the video a thumbs up if you uh, approve of this. If you don't, well, there's many more opportunities to be had in the video. Let's do this. Not bad. I definitely underestimated how much chewing I was gonna have to do for this challenge. Ooh. I've done a lot of pizza challenges in my life, and every time I do them, I'm quickly reminded of how delicious they are. All right, guys, I, I could only last so long. That's what she said. But guess what, guys? It is time for that rancherization that we all like to do. A lot of people like barbecue sauce. I like barbecue sauce. I also like ranch. Some weird people like ketchup. <clears throat> Babe. You guys, we all have our secret condiment, okay? So we're gonna sauce rise right now with some ranch. Step one, take pizza, just like so. Step two, put ranch on top of pizza, like so. Oh goodness gracious, you have ranch and pizza. It's delicious, guys, and totally unnecessary. Well, not in this case. W, O, W moment, woo! I just wanna give a big shout out to Domino's for charging an additional $1.75 for ranch. Come on, people. All right, guys, just like that, our first large pizza is down. Now I think we gotta move on. Where are the wings? Where are my wings? There we are. We're gonna move on to our hot wings. Just like with stomach capacity, you gotta keep pushing your stomach capacity to eat more food. You gotta push your spice level to eat more spice. These don't look too intimidating, but you never know. Sometimes you get surprised. All right, people, let's hope these aren't too hot. They're not that hot. 
Like I can handle this. Like I can. Okay, it's starting to get to me. Oh, that is pretty spicy. Luckily, we can salvage some ranch and go. Boom. Oh, oh my goodness. I know you guys are probably gonna look at me going, Eric, clean your wings, dude. Those are clean to me, all right? So those are definitely spicy. Maybe this will help. And then of course, I remember this is not actual milk with fat in it, which helps with spicy stuff. Oh, well, I'm an idiot. I know, I know. These right here are barbecue wings. Let's do this. That is fire. Woo! All right, guys, well, all the wings are down. Goodness gracious, I need a wet nap. Oh, man. All right, guys, so we have our bread bites left. You guys know I try to show love as much as possible, so I'm gonna show some snaps right now. Yo, oh, what's up, Eric? I don't know what you want to say in the snap, but it's nice to a big fan. Much love, yeah. homie. This will be a video of mine to keep up the good work. I hope you and your GF have all the best in your relationship. Oh, what's going on Eric? I just wanted to wish you a happy new year, man. I hope you're having a great one so far, and I hope it's full of a lot of W-O-W fire, fire, fire moments. My man. Uh, See, that is love and positivity right there. I, I really appreciate that, guys. All the support you guys have given me in 2018. I got a ton of stuff planned. Something I, I wanted to tell you guys is I really want to do competitive eating in public. I think that'd be hilarious. I've been watching a lot of prank channels lately. I think that'd be fantastic to walk into a, a gym full of donuts and just start eating them as fast as possible just to see how people would react. Would you guys watch that? Let me know down below in the description. Now guys, I think we gotta get to some of these bread bites. You know, these look delicious. They look sensational. They're, they're cute. They're like twisting. Because they're twists. Okay, I'm gonna stop now. Now it's come to the time of the video where I can say fitness. Fitness whole cheesy bread twist thingy, whatever this is called in my mouth. Whoo! Triple fire! Amazing, dude. That is sensational. Wow. when you just realized you have marinara sauce to dip a breadsticks in. Oh goodness, we have marinara sauce. Yum. There we go. Oh, oh, there we go. All right, guys, well, those breadsticks are down. It's time to move on. Number two, this is not gonna stay there. Put this right there. Now we gotta do our actual cheesy bread. This stuff is absolutely amazing. The point in time where we can do this, let's do this, people, let's do it. Oh my goodness, look at that. That is a boom moment right there for sure. Man. Sorry, can we just take the moment? Just look at it, people. Just look at it. That's amazing. Whew. I'm sorry. It's insane, guys. So good. Once again, totally unnecessary, but I'm doing it anyways. No hesitation. Gosh. All right, guys, well, I'm an idiot for saving this pizza for last because I feel like my jaw has been doing jaw curls for like four hours right now, but we gotta get to this pizza right here. The buffalo chicken. Oh my gosh, look at it. It's giant and it's staring me right in the face. That's what she said. How many of you are like me as a kid? You always questioned the piece with a giant pizza bubble on it, otherwise known as a cheese bubble. The zit of the pizza, I'm gonna pop it. Popping it does nothing, but whatever. I for sure get Idiot of the Year award for saving this for last. Way to go. At least the pizza's good. To all the kids out there, please don't try this at home. Please don't. Alright guys, well, what I want you guys to do right now is if you're still with the flow of the video, comment down below. Cheesy, because we are really cheesy right now. Call me out all you want, guys, but you gotta do what you gotta do. You gotta do what you gotta do. All right, well, the bread bites are all down. Now I just have this pizza left. We gotta create the ultimate ranch pizza sandwich. There you go. And boom. Don't judge me. Don't judge me. The last piece of pizza. All of our dominoes is down, everyone. If you guys know when it comes to Supercharged Mini Challenges, we have dessert, otherwise known as the bonus round. And you guys know I had to get them. I saw them in the store, the all-new Pop-Tarts Sparklicious Cherry flavor, which look absolutely delicious. 
And of course I got a package in my appeal box from abroad, and I wanted to include some candy bars in this as well. Now I don't know what to start with. Do we start with the Pop-Tarts, or do we start with the Molten Lava Cake? Oh, that's sick. That's tight. Look at that. It says Unicorn Power. Here we go. Also, guys, it tastes like a cherry pop tart, but anything sweet at this point is delicious. <sighs> some exhausted my supply of water, which is good because I need some milk right now after what I just did. Oh. You know, I always have to ask you guys if you guys are team Pop-Tart or team Toaster Strudel. Right now, these actually aren't bad. I'm gonna say I'm team Pop-Tart for this video. Last Pop-Tart, we can go boom. Oh, all right guys, while well, the Pop-Tarts are down now, all we have left is this candy and these lava cakes. Here we go. Yeah, oh yeah. It's lava delicious. I can't believe I just said that, but. It applies in this case. All right, it applies. Here we go. It's like a brownie in liquid form. There you go. The candy got a little destroyed in the package, apparently. Ugh. That has been another video and another supercharged mini challenge. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know down in the comments below and let me know where you guys want me to go for the next supercharged mini challenge. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell right next to that subscribe button so you guys get notified whenever a future upload happens. Follow me on my social media, Facebook, Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram. You know the drill. Thanks again for watching the video, everybody. Roll it.